What's up everyone, it's Neo here with Nexus 7 Soft Modder. Today I'm going to show you how to enable KitKat's immersive mode in only selected applications. Before we showed you how to enable immersive mode and it was a uh, system wide, it did in every application on every screen and it was really cool. It made the screen look a little bit bigger, expanded it by uh, making the status and navigation bar disappear unless I performed the swiping up or swiping down gesture. But unfortunately you don't want that in every single application or screen, let's say your home screen, but it does look good in most social media applications when you're browsing Instagram or you're browsing YouTube or looking at tweets and stuff like that. It looks real good, but I don't like it on my uh, home page. I actually like seeing my soft keys in most stock applications as well in my settings. You have to be rooted running KitKat and you also need exposed framework. After you have those, those two things, just go into exposed you're going to go to download, go to the search bar, and you're going to type in force, and it should be the first thing to come up after you put force. No, it's not. It's actually down here. Force immersive mode on certain apps. So after you do that, you're just going to download, and it's going to install. And after it installs, just exit. Do not hit launch or open. You actually need to um, enable it through expose. So you're going to go bring this pull down, go to framework. Sorry, bring the pull down, go to modules. You're going to check force immersive mode. Make sure it's checked. Then you'll go back to framework and you'll do a soft reboot. Once it reboots, go into your app drawer and look for the actual icon right here. Right down at the bottom, force immersive. It's pretty basic. Well, it's extremely basic. The interface is just add an app, remove, a map, remove an app, help, and then visit the thread. So you just go to add an app. Let's just do, um, let's see, let's do Chrome and Instagram. So Chrome, and let's go down to Instagram. Now you don't need to reboot, but you do need to kill the application if you're in it or it's running in the background while you apply it. So let's go into Chrome right now, check it out. So you can see my navigation and my status bar gone unless I do this little gesture. Oops, unless I do this little gesture and they both come up. And then when I go home, my navigation and status bar are there and immersive mode is disabled. So let's go into Instagram. There you go, soft keys and status bar are gone until I bring them up. And look at that little cute kid. Um, then I just go home again. Oops, go home and there it is, it's disabled again and I have my navigation bar right there. Definitely check out the full article for all the links and all the descriptions on Nexus 7 Softmodder. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks, guys.